This October, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 arrives. Infinity Ward is once again returning to its roots for a modern day action game. And today we're about to show you the world premiere of its gameplay with a level playthrough. To tell us more, let's head to the port of Long Beach to check in with Johanna Ferris, nice. the head of Call of Duty. Let's show actual gameplay now. Hi everyone, in 2019, Modern Warfare changed everything. And on October 28th, we usher in a new era of Call of Duty with the launch of Modern Warfare 2. We are back, we are bigger, and we are bringing the entire team. Price, Gaz, Soap, Alejandro, and of course, Ghost. We needed a stage big enough to debut Call of Duty in a whole new way, inspired by the world we're about to enter. Oil rigs, cargo ships, and staggering odds are just the beginning. Here is Modern Warfare 2. Yes, let's right, go. I'm looking forward to this. In it. This is crazy. Disarm that missile. Be ready for anything. This could be a trap. Actual, we're set. Copy, get to work. Good hook. Up Love these kind of missions. Wow. I cut right clear through. Yeah, I think I remember this from the original Modern Warfare 2. Looks so sick. Room clear, coming out. <coughs> Bless, you. Bless you. Where did that come from? Bless me. Sorry. The graphics on list look so up to date, like movie quality. Mm. And this is like compressed video, so imagine like direct feed from the console itself. What's your status? Boarding the ship with Shadow 3 now. Roger that. Oh, he's gonna shoot him in the head. Oh, he did shoot him in the head. Container now. Two copies, moving. We gotta roll. Shadow one, go. Fire. Why is he not? Flare. Fire. Yeah. Fire. Fire. They're gonna launch that missile. It's first stage. There's no time. All shadows. All shadows. Missile is on the helicopter. Uh uh. Oh, 
That's good. The, the graphics, the way that it looks yeah. very cinematic, it's really good. I mean, it's using the same engine as Modern Warfare 1, but obviously they tweak things about it. Where are the controls? On that damn ship. Actually, we got a problem. This is somewhere on the ship. You have your orders, son. Stop that launch. This stuff's amazing. You see how the water's dropping off the. Yeah, yeah. That looks great. One thing about Modern Warfare is the sound effects are so good. In it. Although the frame rate on the weather effects look like they're like a lower frame rate. Which is weird. Maybe. See the water that's dripping down? Yeah. It's like almost like a lower frame rate than the rest of the gameplay. Do you know if this is coming out on PS4 as well? Oh, I've not noticed what it's said. It's like C4. I don't think they've confirmed yet, have they? Not sure. Boom. Woo! Ah. It looks cool. Pre-order now and get early access to the open base. I will be jumping on this heavy this time. <laughs> it's been a while since I really got into Call of Duty. And that's what we're talking about. And joining us now, up from Long Beach, Johanna, great to see you. How's everything? It's great. Thanks. Uh, great to have you with us. And also Jeff from uh, Infinity Ward. So we saw the first gameplay. Thanks for that extended sequence. Looks incredible. Uh, Jeff, tell us a bit about that mission. Uh, where is that set in the game? What are we seeing there? Absolutely. So, um, first of all, we're really excited to welcome back uh, Captain John Price and uh, uh, Gaz uh, Garrick. Um, you know, they're not re they're not actually in what we just saw today, but uh, they're returning members from 141. And then the other two characters uh, that were you may recognize from the older franchise that we're reimagining are uh, Simon Ghost Riley and uh, of course, uh, Soap John McTavish. Um, and then a couple other new characters in here that we're really excited uh, that we got to uh, create for this game. Um, first, uh, Commander Philip Graves and uh, Mexican Special Forces uh, 
Colonel Alejandro. And Alejandro, I gotta say, we're, it's a character we're really excited about. He's a guy who's super capable and a guy uh, who's just as important as Task Force 141. Um, but as far as the level's concerned, um, you know, this, I, I gotta shout out to, to IW. You know, this was a tremendous collaboration across all of the, the different uh, disciplines. As you saw, everybody coming together, some really uh, motivated devs here. And, uh, you know, you saw the, the wind and the uh, animations and the awesome sound design. And of course, our new water tech, which is actually pushing the boat in different directions. It's creating a physically dynamic environment, allowing for the cover you were seeing. In certain cases, you could be behind cover, and then suddenly that cover would shift and leave you exposed. But it also leaves the enemy exposed, creating this emergent gameplay. Um, so ag again, I'm I'm very excited. Just can't just wait. I'm green so and white. To get <laughs> and that's just a hint Sorry. of where things are going to go. Um, Johanna, tell us a bit and about I... Call of Duty overall, Modern Warfare 2. Obviously, you know we're so excited that it's back this year, but you've got lots going on across Call of Duty. What can we expect from you guys this year? Yeah, we um, first of all, thanks for having us here. We're just so excited for October 28th. It's such a big moment, not just for Modern Warfare 2 and everything that Jeff and the team at Infinity Ward have built, but it really marks the step change, what we're calling a transformational moment for the entire franchise. You're gonna see incredible rendering, incredible graphics, all the things just within the game itself, built all on one shared engine now, across Warzone and Modern Warfare 2 going forward. Of course, there's a lot of chatter and interest about the new Warzone experience, we're affectionately calling it Warzone 2.0. Um, there will be um, a standalone experience of Warzone for current existing um, players as well. So we're going to sort of feed the entire community there. But all eyes on the 28th. Um, and again, I think the collaboration has just been incredible. Everybody's so excited for Task Force 141. Um, Warzone coming to mobile as well for players on the go. We're, we're on Steam, as you know. I mean, so yeah. it's just a big moment, and there's going to be a lot more to come in the, in the months to follow. Well, before we, we leave, we got to ask a little bit about Warzone 2. I know we just, you know, we're showing gameplay here on this, but can you tell us anything? There was a little bit, it seems like there was a little bit of a tease maybe in the trailer yesterday. Or something. Yeah, when we're seeing that from the com community, we love when the fans can pick up some things, um, some chatter about maybe seeing high rise and, and other elements, but we will get into the details of Warzone 2.0. I love for sure. that map. It will be an extension of the Modern Warfare 2 universe. Yeah. So, all the more reason why we think this game, this moment, is, is such an important uh, title for all of us. Looking, looking ahead, and like we said, we're having a bold vision around the entire future for the franchise. So we're in, we're in position. We're really excited. All right. Well, we're looking forward to October. Thanks so much for giving us a first look at the gameplay, Call of Duty: Modern Warfare 2. Thanks, Johanna and Jeff.